Today is National Junk Food Day, so it's no secret that junk food isn't the healthiest option. It is even in the name, but reports like the amount of titanium dioxide in Skittles might have you wondering what other chemicals are in our favorite snacks. So we asked a local registered dietitian with UF Health about the chemicals in junk food, and he says the two chemicals or ingredients that deserve the most scrutiny are sugar and sodium, specifically much of that is in junk food. So eating too much sugar and sodium are really what put you at a higher risk of many chronic diseases like high blood pressure and type 2 diabetes. So how much is too much? It is recommended that you don't have more than six to nine teaspoons of sugar a day. And when it comes to sodium, you should aim for 2300 milligrams or less. The nutritionist recommends that you savor your favorite junk food in small amounts. Stay under 200 calories for whatever your splurge is. 200 calories. It might just be maybe three or four, you know, chips or Skittles. And the key to that is, of course, to portion out small servings and you really need to stick to it. So he points out that you don't want to open a box and eat mindlessly because that one serving quickly becomes one entire box. 